Hello, I'm Michael Lowe. I'm founder and CTO of iConnectivity, and we're stoked to be here at GearFest 2016. This year, we announced and launched our Mio product line. It consists of the Mio 2, the Mio 4, and the Mio 10. What we took all that great MIDI management technology we have and put it into a new product line that we think everybody's going to enjoy and have various workflows for. I like to talk mainly about the Mio 10, but all these products sort of feature the same capabilities I'm going to discuss. The Mio 10 consists of 10 MIDI DINs in and out. So your vintage gear or other things that use that 5-pin DIN MIDI, you've got the capability of bringing that into the Mio 10. Three of the ports are conveniently accessed on the front, so just in case you do rack mount it. And then there's another additional seven ports on the back, which we'll show you later. Uh, in addition, we have two USB device ports. This allows you to hook up two computers at the same time to the Mio 10, and those two computers can share the MIDI information at the same time, synchronized together. So you can imagine your workflows where you're having failover systems or, or synchronization of two computers, or even uh, possibly passing MIDI data between the two computers to do various uh, activities. Uh, we also have actually in the box, various uh, capabilities like filtering, uh, we can MIDI merge, we can uh, pass through to multiple ports. It's pretty much totally assignable and routable inside the box. It actually has 56 ports of MIDI that it manages. So it's quite a powerhouse of a MIDI box. On the, on the back, we also have an Ethernet port. So the Mio 10, it is fully configured uh, just like uh, our other devices with the configuration software, which you can run on both PC or Macintosh, uh, and essentially set your routing and your filtering of, and, and your various other features of the MIDI in our box. But if you want to just get an idea of what's going on in the box with regard to MIDI traffic, you can utilize our touch panel on the front. And you can touch, for example, the MIDI DIN, and that will show you then the activity on the LED indicators of what's going in and out of the Mio 10. The Mio 4 and the Mio 2, of course, just have our standard LED indicators there that you can see what the traffic's going on those. So on the back side, the Mio 10, as indicated, has seven additional MIDI in and out pairs. And then you've got your Ethernet, which you can hook up up to four Ethernet MIDI sessions. So that's an additional four computers that you can add to the routing matrix of this device. So if you count it, that's six computers that this guy can be managing at the same time all your MIDI data. And we do the best we can to make sure that that is extremely low latency and synchronized timing. So we're quite proud of that capability. From the USB host port, you can actually plug in either directly a standard class compliant MIDI controller, or you can plug in a powered USB hub and up to 10 additional devices or 10 additional MIDI ports can be controlled from this device. So this device, the Mio 10, can control up to 20 MIDI peripherals. That's the 10 from the host port plus the additional 10 DIN ports. Plus also that you got the four network session ports of MIDI, 16 channels a piece, remember. And then also each of the device ports, which there are two for the two computers, could do 16 ports of MIDI. So if you add that up, that's 56 ports of MIDI that the Mio 10 can manage for you. Again, any of those ports could be filtered, merged, uh, channel mapped, the, all those features that you buy external boxes for are built into the Mio 10. Really quick, I'd, I'll just in, indicate, it's the same capabilities as the Mio 4, except for you've only got four sets of DENs in and out. So it's got the ethernet, the two USB device ports for two computers, the host port and uh, the four mini den pairs. The Mio 2 is just the uh, two in, two out uh, mini den pairs, and it's also only got the two device ports. There's no host port on that, but a lot of you could utilize that with multiple computers and two sets of den pairs. I'd like to thank you. Uh, it's been a great time here at GearFest 2016. If you want more information or need more information, please talk to your Sweetwater sales engineer. Have a great day.